Good morning. Um, my name is Olive Shocknessy and um, I have been attending the um, Neurofeedback Clinic for the last, this is my fifth session, and I would like, um, I suppose, to just tell people my experience and how it's been going for me. I am um, a mum of four children. I'm a 44-year-old, I think 44, 44 44-year-old mum of four beautiful children. I was told that um, I had broken my neck. So I couldn't understand how my neck was broken, but they had told me out of the seven vertebrae, four of them had been rotted away with cancer and that my bones were full of holes. And I said, I don't understand what you mean by bones full of holes. And the professor said, unfortunately, I'll have, I haven't the tests done, but I think you have a stage four cancer. So it had started in my breast and it had moved up my spine, down my back. And it then broke my neck, obviously, and a little bit into my lung. It was a huge, huge, um, obviously, oh my God, what do you say? I mean, our lives were turned upside down. Now, to get, uh, that's just a little bit of my history. Um, every time I exercise, I break bones. So I have put on a lot of weight, which is a problem for me. Um, but otherwise, I don't have a lot of gripes with my life. Life has been very, very good, and people have been extremely kind. And that's actually how I was introduced to to um, to, to, the, to actually even get on this. I was um, Janet was kind enough to um, offer me um, a go off this, and I will say. Without a shadow of a doubt, this has made a huge, huge difference in my life. There's been three, two or three different things I needed to tackle. Um, one was my sleep. Um, I was not sleeping at all. I don't think I slept probably for four years. Every time I get into the bed, um, I get severe leg cramps. And my poor husband has been already sent into orbit because I wake him every time. So I was feeling guilty about that. And of course, then climbing the stairs was like my Everest. I wasn't able to get up the stairs. So I had to get a room downstairs that I call my healing room. But even to get into that bed, it was a complete challenge. Um, I get one hour of sleep and I'd be on the recliner and then lap up with leg cramps and start doing arts and crafts and distracting myself. So it has been a huge issue because I know healing is a lot of healing happens when you sleep. And I know I'm missing out on that. Um, then I had a problem with, um, I suppose, food. Not so much food as in eating the wrong food, but my weight. Um, the tablets increased my appetite. Uh, even though I eat healthy, I have dub I've doubled in my size, which is a problem for me. Not a vanity thing. It's just I don't want to get diabetes or other conditions. So all these were my challenges. So um, I was really, really hoping and that something would happen, that it would change. Because it's the only gripes I have. Life is very, very good otherwise. Um, I've tried to help myself as good as I can. I've tried to be I'm a positive person. I keep all the negative um, the vampires out of my life and try and surround myself with positive people, which thankfully is all I am lucky enough to be introduced to. But um, when I did start my first session, uh, instantly I found myself relaxing, which was great. Um, I would be, I suppose, full of life, full of beans, but I needed to kind of sometimes just come down to a level. And I found uh, just, just sessions are so, so relaxing. I so enjoy them. Um, within, I said, a minute, I'm, I'm going to, to La La Land. Um, and it works. I mean, it's, it's your subconscious. It's not as if that I'm not enjoying it. The music, it's just fantastic. And then I'm so happy to say I have noticed difference in my sleep. The re just the whole relaxation and the happiness within myself. I couldn't really explain it, but I said I felt very content. I felt um, it wasn't any one specific thing that was making me happy. I just felt at peace with myself. Um, there's it's it's just such an easy thing to do. I mean, you just get the little uh, little thing, I don't know what you call them little like wires just left on your head, and you watch the screen. And it's all these beautiful colours and relaxing music. There's nothing to be scared of. It's not an invasive procedure whatsoever. Um, it's a lovely, calm environment. Uh, I just really and truly think, think that I'd like to express to people to give this a go. It was new to me. I didn't know about it before. It has, without a shadow of a doubt, made a difference in my life. Um, and I'd wish that for other people. Like, if you're struggling with something, you've got nothing to lose by trying this. Um... I would have went to the ends of the earth. I thought I'd never sleep again, to be quite honest. I thought my days of going to bed and getting a full night's sleep was a thing of the past. And it used to bother me then when the nurses were saying, Olive, you know, you have to sleep. It's for your health. And I'd be thinking, I've tried everything else. Why am I letting myself down with this? Now the fact that I can sleep three or four hours a night and it has it's improving all the time. Um, I went away with my friend there a couple of weeks ago and she said, Olive, she said, do you realise you slept the full night? I, I slept before her and I slept at six in the morning and I didn't even realise that I'd done that. So it might, I mean, there, there's nobody in the healing room with me at the moment because the kids have now 
Tom upstairs. Um, but I hope in the next couple of weeks to be um, losing the weight a little bit more and be able to go back up to my own room and make life as normal as I can. Um, normality and consistency is very important for me and the kids. So like I said, um, give it a go. You've got absolutely nothing to lose. And I really and truly feel that you'll get more benefits than I, just even just to relax your mind and get your mind settled and, and ground you because cancer and any illness indeed takes time to process and this just seems to give you that little bit of me time on your own to work through it and I wish everybody well and health that's watching this and uh, may all good things happen to you and God bless. Thank you. <laughs>